Greetings, 100 adult students. We're going to spend a little bit of time tonight working through Ipan Kumite. And I know that I had a chance to personally do some of these with uh, some of our adults about a week or so ago. We're going to make sure we go over the exercise with partners, though, and go through some of the finer points today. So Senpai is going to help me out. I always bow to your partner. Now, I'm going to demonstrate them with a partner. Of course, if you don't have a partner at home, it's totally cool to not do them with a partner. It is really good to practice both the attacking end and the defense end. So you get a chance to do both parts of the exercise. And always, you can always grab somebody at home to have them help you. Just go slow and be careful, right? So Senpai's in his fighting stance. Yeah. He's going to step in for number one to my head. He punches. I step back and block in my, my stance. I rotate and punch. Yeah. Make our stance. He stays there, I stand up. So this is gonna be the format for all four of these techniques we're gonna practice. White belts, your focus is gonna be number one. I'll do it again. One, two, three, four. Now next, yellow belts, we're gonna work on number two. Number two is gonna be the outside block and we're protected the chest. So Senpai steps in, I step back and block. I wanna make sure I get that good wind up in there and block it all the way to the side turn, deliver my punch. Yeah. Fighting stance, and up. Now we'll put it together. Yeah. Yeah. The next technique is gonna be Ipan Kumite number three. That's when Senpai punches down low to the groin, and I have to make sure I block with my low block. One, two, and three, four. All right, Senpai's got a fast punch, so be ready for that at home. He's gonna come in a little faster, a little stronger. I'm gonna block right away. Yeah. Yeah. So again, yellow belts, orange belts, two and three are where you live. And, and a good thing to try to do is do these on the opposite side. So Senpai will switch sides. And I'm gonna go one, two, and three, left foot back, right hand block, and, and again, take it slow, make sure you have the right, right foot back before you try the left. So one, yeah. Number two, yeah. and number three. Now, around green belt level is when we start getting in number four, and that's a little more advanced. So I'm, I'm selecting to break this one down on its own for you guys. Senpai's gonna switch back to right foot behind him. He's gonna punch to my chest, and I have to do an inside block. So he punches, inside block, roundhouse knife hand, draw it back, hold on to the arm, pull him into the elbow. Make your stance, and we come up. So I'll do that again a little faster. One. Two, three, and remember, keep your back straight, pull them in. Stance, and then I stand up, all right? Now he'll switch sides, and he'll practice punching me with the other hand. I have to block with my other hand. One, two, draw it back, three, take, stance, and then I'm going to stand up. I'll put the whole thing together one time for you. In. In. Thank you, Senpai. Thank you. Just remember that when you're practicing these at home, it's really good to, again, do not only the blocking side, but also the attacking side. If you don't have a partner, practice both sides, both pieces of that separately, and then try to put it together later on when you have your partners in class. Good luck, everybody. We're going to move on next to a couple kata. All right, and so of course, white and yellow belts practice your Taikyoku Shodan and your Taikyoku Nidan. Tonight, we're gonna hit a few more advanced kata, Taikyoku Sandan and Pinan Shodan. And white and yellow belts, I invite you to follow and try some of these as well. It's always great to get a head start. So, I'll start attention. Remember, a chance to show your personal confidence. Body up tall, good posture. Taikyoku Sandan. break down the individual movements. The inside block always chambers under the arm. Back stance, one. Then I'm gonna step in, lunge, punch to the chest. Step back, inside block, one. Lunge, punch to the chest. 
This is a low block to the front. Remember guys, you gotta use two hands. Lunge punch to the nose, two more ki. This hand, the hand at your waist, is gonna chamber under the arm as you turn and block. Punch to the chest. And again, opposite way. Punch to the chest. Now from the ear, two hands. Head level, punch. Two more with the key up. Head spin and block. One. Punch. Two. Step back and block. One. Key eye. Ah! Step back. Look to the front. Always finish with a good bow. Again, what you'll notice is I took an opportunity to pause on the, on the chamber positions for the blocks just so you can check yourself and make sure you're learning proper. As you get better, speed it up. Let's go to Pinan Shodan. So attention, this kata's Pinan Shodan. Pinan Shodan! Joy, ready position. All right, guys, let's pick it up. Now we got these low blocks down from our previous kata. So one, punch to the chest, two, one. Now this is a little different. So it's in, up, and down. So in, up, down. We'll put it together, then punch. Low block to the front. In and up, open the hand. Upper block, two more. Hit! Now this next piece, very similar to Taikyoku Shodan. Low block, punch. Low block, punch, low block, punch, punch, punch. Yeah! Now four chops. Remember your, your rhythm on this. So I spin, stretch it out from the ear, back stance and chop. Now to the corner. So I look to the corner, stretch, chop. Opposite side, chop. Look to the corner, stretch, and chop. Now back to the rhythm. It's a one and two, a three and four. So one and two, three and four. Finish. And bow. And again, that rhythm's gonna come into play once you've got a little more confidence with it. Take your time. Again, feel free to post questions, reach out to us, pictures, videos, what have you. That's going to help us help you do a better job. Good luck, everybody. We'll see you soon.